What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of the Greasy Duel. Today we're doing something special. We're going to make some movie posters uh, for each other and uh, decide who is the best at doing so. And whoever wins gets another point in the duel. The scores so far are 2-0 uh, to zero, uh, with me in the lead because I'm uh, much better than uh, Nick Mac. At pretty much uh, everything. Okay, so uh, me and Nick Mac, we have each made three uh, prompts each, uh, one for each movie, and then we're going to make uh, three posters each and uh, uh, compete with each other to see who made the, the best uh, poster. And we're getting uh, points according to these uh, criteria. Criteria, right there. Uh, who, who should start uh, drawing or uh, making? I think uh, you can start drawing. Yes, show me your keywords. Alright, so this is uh, my prompt to the first movie that Nick Mimaki is going to make a poster to. Okay. The, the genre is uh, drama, experimental, absurdist. Mm -hmm. The theme is isolation. Uh, adjective wandering. That's Nick up to you how you interpret the words there, Nick Mac. Uh, okay. <laughs> A picture element, Home Alone, house logo, and the sentence is uh, Home Alone, but it's 4P. Yeah, that, that's the plot to the movie. And the picture element is something he has to put in the poster. Alright, Nick Mac, you, you're free to go. We're okay. going to make it in paint. Okay, uh, the poster is probably something like this in size. Yeah. Maybe he still lives uh, at his parents' house, and when uh, his parents are... Uh, uh, at work or something, he, he decides to leave the house, and that's uh, that's the wandering. He just goes away, you know. That's a pretty uh, literal uh, interpretation, but that is entirely up to you how you yeah. think about this. First of all, I just uh, had the Home Alone logo. Remember, you have to make your own uh, title for a movie, so you have to be a little bit creative. Uh, okay, I need to, I need to find a man who could be uh, Kevin when he's uh, older, when he's forty. Do you mean the actor? <laughs> no, I won't. Uh, he's probably forty by now, so you could just take a picture of him. No, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why wouldn't you do that? <laughs> the poster would be so much better if you just chose <laughs> that. <laughs> okay, okay. There is. How, how do you say that name? He's 42. Oh, that's actually very spot on. Maybe I should use this. <laughs> yeah, I think that fits very good. Okay. Now I'll use the magic select tool. And it really is magic. Because um, as oh, good damn. it's pretty good uh, sometimes at spotting uh, the main object of the image. Here we have Kevin, 40 year old. <laughs> oh, I, I have an idea. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Goofy well, ass. You see the house there? I want the mm. footsteps to come from the house to him. Ah, that's what you're doing here. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. This is starting to look, look good already. Okay, maybe I should come up with a title now. I mean, a Home Alone needs to be in the title. Yeah, that's, that's kind of obvious. Should I call it Home Alone, Nobody Home? Because when he leaves, there's literally nobody home. <laughs> When he was home alone, he just w went away. Where, where is he going? <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to come up with something more clever, but uh, I kind of like the nobody home one. Fuck it. Nobody home. Home alone, nobody home. <laughs> In caps lock. Yeah. Or maybe the E should not be in caps lock because ah. that's not the case there. Eh? But I still need a catchphrase. There will be nobody home when this film comes out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that, okay. Yeah, that was actually really good. There will be nobody home. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> there will be nobody home. You're just uh, making uh, the point again that there's actually <laughs> nobody in the house. <laughs> That was kind of good, but uh, it's your idea. Yeah, so, uh, that's true, that's true, you can't take that. 
But it, this is still a good one. This yeah. movie. <laughs> this movie. <laughs> uh, and uh, it's the New York, the New York Times who said that, <laughs> or maybe maybe not. I'm not so. <laughs> it's even funnier. If, it's funnier if, if, the, if the director said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's the director of the original ones? I, it's funnier if you don't quote anybody, in my opinion. <laughs> it, it's just there. <laughs> it actually looks like a, a speech bubble, almost. <laughs> yeah, maybe, uh, maybe it should be. <laughs> he's aware that he's, that he's in a movie. Why is he aware that he's in a movie? <laughs> On the poster. Of course it's the wrong <laughs> way. <laughs> the speech bubble is the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it doesn't matter, it doesn't fit. What do you mean it doesn't fit? It, it literally fits in <laughs> what they're talking about. Yeah, but it doesn't fit his mouth. His mouth? Well, oh. I don't think this will win the most pleasing to look ah, at category. But... Actually, uh, there is something about the simplistic nature of this uh, poster that is not that bad, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> so that's uh, that actually ruins the the looks of the poster a lot. <laughs> I'll just have it like this. Well, the orange one is not that bad either. Okay, I, right. um, am I done? Well, yes. Uh, isolation. I don't really. Mm, yeah, that's that's true. But you might get some uh... minus points. M All right. So I'm looking at it now for the first time. <laughs> All right, it's a horror movie with. Blood and guts. That's the theme of the movie. Blood it's, and guts. It's a very gory movie. <laughs> and it's also erotic. Yeah. <laughs> it needs to contain Dwayne the Rock Johnson. <laughs> the plot of the movie is: in order to have sex, they, they have to make a sex. <laughs> that's that's where the blood and guts go, goes. In. I love how the it doesn't specify more. Is it like in general? Like everybody in the world. No, no, needs no. To... Uh, you could interpret it as that, but I imagine it was just a couple who, uh, for some reason, maybe there was like a curse on them that in order to have sex they had to sacrifice something. Um, how horny do you need to be to, <laughs> to, to kill someone? Because it, you have to. Have it sex. can be an animal as well. Or what, what happens if I type or. Oh, I, I kind of like this one, actually. The forest uh, one. But uh, does forest really fit what you're going for? I mean, in my head right now, Dwayne Rock Johnson and his uh, wife, they're uh, uh, witch witches and a wizard. <laughs> and uh, they're evil. So they don't care they, if they have to sacrifice in order they to... They live in the woods. Are you kidding me? But I have an idea. You can, you can just... Can't I just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess you if you just use this simple trick right now, yeah, you can, don't have uh, to pay for any images. Alright. Alright, so I don't have to show uh, Dwayne Rock Johnson having sex. I don't want to give away the plot in uh, the movie poster. I just want people interested in the movie, you know. Uh. But uh, in the description, Nick Mac told me that I have to use a picture of Dwayne Rock Johnson. <laughs> so <laughs> Dwayne Rock Johnson. Scary. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good one for a horror poster. <laughs> this one? Actually, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, uh, you... Magic Select. Uh, there's a guy on the floor there. <laughs> that's the guy that's the he's uh, sacrificing. Uh, uh, what's going on with his head? What's <laughs> so now you have him cropped out. It looks so heinous that his uh, head is flat. <laughs> Try to... Uh, Try to ignore that. <laughs> should, oh. should I add that for it? <laughs> what do we call it? Um, maybe I can work in uh, the erotic part in the title. <laughs> I have no idea what that, that, that It's not even funny. Uh, Dwayne the Witch Johnson <laughs> because it's a Dwayne the Rock Johnson and Dwayne, <laughs> Dwayne the Witch Johnson. Um, it's kind of funny. It's kind of funny, but it's a terrible title. Home of Home, Nobody Home is not a good title either. That's, <laughs> that's, that's true. Uh, I don't know which is worse actually. <laughs>
Ah, uh, fuck it. I'll, I'll spend enough time here already. Maybe it just works with red like this. It's hard to read the the witch. Uh, if you're blind. Yeah, but it's it just looks bad, you know. <laughs> That's true. You, you don't want your poster to be kind of. You need to kind of squint to read it. Uh, and the catchphrase. What what's the difference with? A regular text and 3D text. The regular text you can't move around. <laughs> <laughs> are, are, are you ready to read the full... Uh, Should uh, I look away until you're done? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Alright, so you know this is a horror movie, right? So oh. it's going to be scary. So I uh, took a regular saying and uh, took my own uh, spin on it because the Dwayne is there. He's going to... <laughs> Scary or rock song. <laughs> Instead of your socks. Uh. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense, but it's 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 funny enough. I actually think it's really funny. Uh, it's, uh, it's funny. It's easier to read here. But it That's doesn't true. it looks kinda out of place here. Yeah it, it fits to have it on the right side better. Uh. <laughs> there's there's so much to think about when they make a movie poster guys. Uh. You don't realize it. I think I'm happy. Okay, you're done. Yes, so now it's, uh, now it's yet again uh, my turn. And I'll check out uh, the prompts for uh, the second one. Yes. A musical. Yes, <laughs> okay. sir. Friends and Enemies is the theme. And it's a satirical musical. Mm. And the poster has to include uh, someone looking bamboozled. <laughs> And uh, the plot is a Broadway mus musical about Hitler's inner circle during the world. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, so it's a, it's about uh, friends and enemies. So maybe uh, the enemies are uh, the allies. That's the first thing that comes to mind. Um, but a musical. <laughs> how can how in the world could this be a musical? I, I actually, uh, I'm really surprised nobody has taken this idea already. I think this is a genius idea. If anyone in the Broadway is uh, watching right now, and hit me up. After this you already have a poster for it. Uh, <laughs> look up some pictures and maybe uh, the creativity will uh, <laughs> Flow. get flowing. Uh, yeah, but wh what should I look up then? Hitler? Yeah. Okay. Let's, let's, let's that start. was obvious. Let's of start course. there. Maybe I should use uh, uh, this the Charlie Chaplin one because he's kind of a uh, he could fit in a musical. Yeah, I actually think you like him. The picture of him here could work. Okay, that's uh, pretty good. Maybe he's friends with uh, furries <laughs> or something. Ooh. Because it's just the satirical, he's just making fun of Hitler. That uh, in reality, his real friends were just furries. Also, the his inner circle is portrayed by being animals. Yeah, yeah that's uh, yeah. furries. Google Nazi furries, maybe. <laughs> if that exists, <laughs> maybe I should use them. <laughs> Okay, this is the foreground with uh, the furs and Hitler. Um, but what should be in the background? And I don't really know what this is about. This is not looking good, to be honest. I, I don't have uh, high hopes. Cool background. <laughs> this. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah. Uh, this is awful. <laughs> Are you sure about the background here? No, but uh, I'm too lazy to find something else. Okay. I guess I'll uh, find a title now. I want to make a word play on uh, on something uh, the Nazis would say. Like mm -hmm. Sieg something <laughs> or Heil something. Yes, yeah, Sieg and then another word. That would be funny, actually. But what should that word be? Sieg meow? <laughs> because it's a furry thing. <laughs> I want to use red and, uh, and white. 
That's what I did with. Uh, yeah, with but the rock it kind of it kind of fits the the Nazi flag theme. Ah, oh, that that is true actually. And then uh, I have a uh, lots of space for the uh, the quote. Catchphrase. The catchphrase on the middle here. Um, oh no, this will be hard. <laughs> it has to be as corny as Sig now. Mm. He was portrayed as evil, but. <laughs> but <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> but. <laughs> but. <laughs> furry and Fuhrer. Maybe I could do, do something there. Ah. On the outside, he was known as their Fuhrer. But he always knew himself as their fur, their furry. <laughs> uh, that's that's uh. the best I could uh, come up with. And I think I'm done now. Uh, it doesn't really fit uh, the description, or uh, it is uh, not even completely close to what I was imagining. But I like that you uh, when you went for uh, the furry stuff, you you went all in on it. Uh. Yeah, that, that, the word free wasn't even used in my description of this. Well, your turn. Are you excited to show to see the prompts? Yeah, that's the best part. All right, so you got a romance. The theme is African village. Nick Mac, I, I don't think you know what theme is in a movie. <laughs> no. <laughs> You don't know? <laughs> Maybe I don't, but uh, keep on. <laughs> Gay. <laughs> Dildo. <laughs> needs to be here. But this starvation is not a problem when you have your office. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> don't make me do this, Nick. <laughs> Please, I'm begging you. <laughs> this is just a porn movie. A gay porn movie. <laughs> so I need to make a poster for her. <laughs> Alright, let's go on Flickr again. Ah, why, why don't you just use Google Images? Oh, well, obviously we need to have a village here. This one, maybe. Okay. <laughs> and you have to try to portray that, that it is gay somehow. Yeah. Uh, I can't wait to see the name and the uh, catchphrase for this one. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Dillo. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I, I can use this guy or something. <laughs> yeah, he, per he perfectly fits the theme here. <laughs> I maybe some starving children in the back. Jesus Christ. <laughs> or maybe not children. <laughs> this is the main character. I need to have him on the bottom because his legs are cropped out. <laughs> African people. Oh, these are just face uh, shots. Can I Google full body <laughs> shot? <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Remember the starvation theme? Uh, they don't have to starve in the vision. <laughs> starve in the vision. Well, his legs. Oh my god, of course. It just had to be like that. Well, what should I add there to uh, <laughs> make the plot come alive? A plate uh, not full of food. <laughs> Nick Egg. Uh, they're uh, women. Uh, yeah, but, uh, so what? <laughs> but it's a like gay mo gay yeah, ass it, movie. It can be women in the movie. <laughs> Just in the corner there. <laughs> you see it's a square of people. <laughs> I can't even see what it is now. <laughs> Praying. Uh, what? Go see <laughs> He's angry. <laughs> <laughs> that was obvious, wasn't it? I don't know. I mean, uh, when you think about what kind of movie this is, the title is going to be something really stupid. <laughs> angry boys. <laughs> <laughs> angry boys. 
Angry boys. <laughs> they are really hungry. <laughs> and really gay. <laughs> I actually just prefer that they are really hungry. Okay, I'm fucking unfinished. I don't know. Okay. Uh, and now it's my last turn. Yes. Let's uh, take a look. Film noir. Yeah. Sociopathy. That's the, the theme. Yeah. Slow burn. Uh, a picture element is a duck with a question mark. Uh, and the plot here is uh, the private investigator is put on a murder case, but only credible suspects are ones you would never suspect. Mm. This is the worst one yet. <laughs> Let's go in the paint. Yes, sir. Okay, last uh, chance to uh, get some points there, Nick Mick. Okay, but I imagine uh, black and white. Okay, maybe this one is good. Oh, it's. Five pixels. Oh, this is a good poster one because I have a lot of space here for uh, title. Yeah, actually. So I think I'll uh, I'll be going for this one. Maybe it's about a uh, woman protagonist for uh, one time sake. <laughs> uh, but I have to say, if you want to get some more uh, creative points, you need to have some more hair. You can just have that picture. <laughs> I uh, need a duck as well. Yeah, that's right. I think that uh, this would be a good poster if you would not need to have a duck hair. Because it kind of ruins the... Uh, I have no idea. Okay. Uh, it's kind of unhinged, but the, <laughs> the detective is a duck. It's called Detective Duck. Or <laughs> and she's the, she's the main character, but she's also the... She's kind of a killer, a sociopath murderer, and the duck That's the antagonist, that's the, it's yeah. the woman. Yeah. And the okay. duck has to solve the mystery. <laughs> I don't know why they selected a duck as their uh, chief, but... Uh, uh, can but the duck talk? Or? <laughs> no. <laughs> Would that be a really boring movie? Okay, uh, you can talk. <laughs> This is a really bold move, I'm not sure if this will pay out well for you. It's kinda hard to see a little bit. Ah, yeah, I'm not gonna... Shut up. Sure, Duck Holmes. Sorry, I, I tried. That's the best I could come up with. Sure, Duck. Sure, Duck. Sure, Duck. Duck, Duck. Duck, Duck. Duck, Duck. Duck, Duck. Duck, Duck. Duck, Duck. Does duck does ducks have cocks? Yeah, they must have. What else do they? <laughs> but uh, I can't imagine they have a, I, I, I never seen a duck dick boom. Duck dick. Yeah, that works. Yeah. Okay, that uh, <laughs> that's that looks kind of good actually. That's the duck detective. The, <laughs> shut up. Uh. What should I call it? Detective Duck? Or uh, the That's duck... The, oh, now I'm going to call it the Duck Detective. <laughs> the Duck Detective. <laughs> the Duck Detective. It's kind of mouthful to say, but... Uh, no, the the D is uh, too big. And I've been in... Mom is Imagine if you had the woman down in the right corner and then the smoke would turn into the title. That would not look good. <laughs> not in Microsoft Paint. <laughs> okay, I think I need to figure out the catchphrase first. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> <laughs> I thought the duck could talk. <laughs> not in the catchphrase. <laughs> okay. He fucks, he quacks, he... Uh, he cracks the mysteries. <laughs> that's that's it. 
<laughs> Please make the duck say this with a speech bubble. <laughs> <laughs> he, he describes himself in third person. Uh, he fucks, he cracks, he cracks the mystery. Shouldn't it be the mystery? <laughs> but that, that that spoils the movie. <laughs> that he, he solves it. <laughs> he just solves mysteries. Nah, you, you don't know what. Uh, it's too uh, big. Uh, Your sh- mom shut is too... Uh, what's another word for mystery? Cock? He solves the, the puzzles. <laughs> the he cracks the enigma. <laughs> the enigma call. He cracks the problem. <laughs> or maybe just he cracks. <laughs> he cracks. Voice crack. crack. <laughs> ah, there we go. Am I done? You know, slow burn. How can I? No. Have, no can I add that in the no, no, that's that's difficult then, but. Uh, uh. <coughs> Film noirs are usually a slow burn, I would say. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm done. All right. The duck tec- duck detective. Yes, are you, are you ready? Yes. No. No. All right, this is the last poster for the video, guys. Fortunately. All right. So <laughs> okay. Uh, there have been sex jokes in both uh, the first two. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm kind of tired of that. Please. Uh, I, don't, I don't really remember what's on the third one. Please give me a good one there. We'll both be surprised there. Uh, action uh, superhero movie. Okay. Yeah. A grand. Like a mom movie. <laughs> of course, not so legible. Instead of fighting crime, this superior fights for <laughs> equality. <laughs> is this a movie about Martin Luther King Jr. Maybe? Hey, so, someone could say he's a <laughs> superhero. <laughs> That's how I interpret this. Or maybe Malcolm X. <laughs> Probably. I've been uh, made a movie about him already, so I can just <laughs> steal those. <laughs> Malcolm X uh, movie poster. <laughs> I could just just dig this on, <laughs> but it needs to contain a lot lots of like with. <laughs> yeah, just put some on the side. Put <laughs> some. Put some. Not all uh, heroes uh, wear caves. caves. <laughs> Not all heroes are white. I have a dream, but I fucked your mom. <laughs> and with the catchphrase, I have a dream. <laughs> That's the catchphrase. <laughs> and this Malcolm X is the wrong person. <laughs> no Malcolm, no peace. No X, no Malcolm. Okay, my main man, Malcolm, needs to be. Uh, <laughs> and this is, a, this is a good one. Oh no, his shoulders his are shoulder. cropped off. <laughs> but there his uh, shoulder shows at least. Yeah, but uh, it's, it must be hard to use the magic marker. Almost. Because he's black. <laughs> <laughs> Not because he's black and white. <laughs> well, yeah, we can, can try. try. Yeah. Okay. That's good. My main man. And we have uh, this is the main antagonist. <laughs> These three. That guy's room so broken. So they are going to be in color. Yeah. It's just Malcolm X that uh, lived uh, a long time ago, so uh, <laughs> he's black and white. Uh, uh, the, the top of his hat, uh, the guy on the left. The guy on the who, left. Who was left? There, right. <laughs> I think we're. Uh, I think we're onto something. Where's the title going to be? Ah. Uh, how does Marvel we'll do it? They have it at the bottom. Below... Uh... Below Malcolm. Okay, what, what should I call it? Uh, maybe a pun on the uh, Marble Infinity War. What runs with Infinity? They call it the war. Yeah, that's... Uh, I should have thought about that image. Mm. That looked kind of cool, but it's... Uh, it needs to you... have something... Uh, something else. Maybe yeah, you're not done yet. 
Ja, uh, yeah, but something in the the title it, it looks kind of naked. Just like this, or what do you think? Uh, well, it's your poster. I can't. I won't have. Okay, to. don't give me minus points uh, for that later. <laughs> I'll give you minus points for whatever I want. <laughs> well, this actually kind of looks like a Marvel poster with like the bad guys at the top there. Uh, he needs to be black and white as well. Maybe. No. No? <laughs> Only Malcolm. You see, the Marvel posters are very colorful, so we need some color here. Uh, like the brown? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, I like this one. Even though his legs are cropped out, I don't give a fuck. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's his testicles. <laughs> this will be a masterpiece remake. Really? Mal Just that could be it. the X in Malcolm X or something. <laughs> 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 Not to piss on your uh, poster, but uh, won't, j won't this look very crowded? Uh, the Marvel posters are crowded, but uh, uh. they're crowded in a sort of a way that looks good. <laughs> but this doesn't look very good. <laughs> <laughs> because there's not uh, a lot of things here. Uh, well, I need to have uh, space for a punchline. <laughs> he had a dream. <laughs> Malcolm? Uh, well, it doesn't specify uh, who had the dream, but <laughs> it would seem like it was Malcolm. <laughs> <laughs> he had a dream. He had a dream. Okay, we need uh, the whole squad. Uh. Yeah, she's, she's a little bit older here. No, oh, there's something missing here. Okay, w one last person. Okay. Black, right. Uh, activists. There's only this motherfucker in every picture. <laughs> Who are these people? A, b a black guy. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Now we're uh, now we're talking, Nick Mac. Do you see this? I'm uh, pretty much done here. <laughs> are you done? <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> Don't you like it? Okay, so here here we have them, and now we're going to to give them to points. Give them points based on uh, these five criteria. So the first one is looks. Uh, which of these posters uh, is the most pleasing to look at? Yeah. I mean, uh, I'm not going to. Uh, I'm, I'll, I'll try to be as unbiased as possible. Yeah, uh, right. I think that the, the dark colors of uh, Malcolm E. Colter uh, works in that poster's favor. The the orange is kind of very. Uh, you see it immediately, but it's not. It doesn't look that well. I don't know. I think mine looks m the most professionally looking because yeah, as <laughs> professionals wouldn't you know crop it out and <laughs> that is true. Okay, I, I I'll vo I'll vote for uh, my <laughs> the Home Alone one. You do? Yeah, uh, <laughs> these guys are just floating in space. <laughs> that is true, but it doesn't look that bad. <laughs> yeah, it does. It doesn't look good. All right. Okay. <laughs> Nick Max uh, that, picks. That's my honest opinion. Gets the point there. Title. Title. Uh, that's yours. <laughs> you think so? Uh, yeah. It does. Does sound like a Marvel Infinity War. Uh, yeah. All right. You agree? Yeah. I'm not gonna argue, argue with you. <laughs> Catchphrase. There will be In nobody <laughs> home when this movie comes oh, that, out. That's the, that goes to this for my... Versus, he had a dream. <laughs> ah, okay, yeah, I agree. Uh. Creativity. I, uh, I'm going to give this uh, to Nick Mac. <laughs> Me too. Uh, the the it... footsteps uh, was uh, a really nice touch on uh, uh. this one. The last one is best fit, and that means uh, fitting the best fitting for this. Uh, uh, her. I think mine fits well. 
I, I think you you win that one because um, uh, I didn't really uh, wondering isolation drama. Okay, what when I first the, made the, the these are hard prompts to have in a poster, but uh, uh, but what I thought when I initially made the prompt is that. Uh, uh, it is another Home Alone movie, but he's 40 years old now, and uh, it's it's not cool to be Home Alone. Like he wishes to have uh, maybe a family or something. Okay, so uh, Nick Mac has three points. And, uh, two. Okay, this is the next uh... Sig Mao versus Dwayne the Witch Johnson. Okay. All right. First of all, looks. <coughs> I think yours is a little bit messy, Sigma. There's there's a lot going on there. Oh, the no. Colors. The um. the background doesn't really fit. <laughs> yeah, why the fuck did you choose that background? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> All right, do we agree that uh, Andrew Rich Johnson looks better? Uh. Okay, title. Okay, uh, this is not the even a question. It must be Sigma. <laughs> Seeing now is really bad. <laughs> I, I think it's really good, actually. It's better than Dwayne the Witch Johnson, isn't it? Or okay. <laughs> Catch race. On the outside, he was known as the Refuter, but he always knew himself as the I, Furry. I think mine is too long and complicated. Yours <laughs> is just. Uh, <laughs> He's going to scare your rocks off. <laughs> uh, I think yours uh, is better. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. <laughs> Creativity. Hmm. Um. Now nah, this this is a goes to Sigma because uh, the fact that you made it about f furries wasn't even in the description. Uh. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Best fit. We need to I look mean, at the... Uh, yours doesn't even fit a little bit. Friends and enemies. It's supposed to be amusing. And it's... The picture element is someone looking bamboozled and it uh, didn't even have that. Uh, so... Uh, uh, it goes to yours. Uh, I'm going to lose right now. <laughs> I just know it. Uh, okay, uh, looks. Looks. It goes to my, to my poster. Um, or do probably. You? I have to say, I actually don't think it's, it's that bad. I like actually the... I think the pink coloring works good with the uh, blue and green there, actually. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. But um, but look at this. This is supposed Wait. to be a crowd of people. Yeah, you can't even and it's, see it's a square. It's you just uh, gave no fucks about uh, making that look realistic. Yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, yours. Yeah. Okay. Uh, title. Yeah, title. Uh. The Detective versus Hungry Boys. <laughs> I think both of them are really bad. Yeah. Uh, it, yours is kind of clever. With the duck. Uh, mine is a little bit more clever because it's a wordplay. Uh, I think but, uh, mine is funnier. Uh, about the uh, split. Split. Uh, you okay. don't give a point there. Catchphrase. He fucks, he quacks, he cracks the mystery. Versus, they're really angry. Uh, yours is funnier probably, mine is uh, better. Yeah, I agree. But I think it goes to, I would say it goes to mine. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah. I can't really uh, argue <laughs> for <laughs> mine. They are starving. No, they, they are, are starving. <laughs> they are really hard. <laughs> that should be the game. That would be They're even starving. Best. Maybe, like, if you get another point, you have won uh, this uh, episode of the duel. You didn't need to say that because I, um, I don't have the count. That would make it more exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Maybe the viewers don't in time count either. Creativity. Uh, I thought it was kind of creative to have the duck as the detective. That's the. Uh, and your catchphrase was a little bit creative. I'll give you that. 
Uh, I, I'm sorry to say it, but I think uh, <laughs> this one was the <laughs> goddamn hungry boys. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, okay. Wait. What's the What's the last? The best fit. That goes the uh, uh, no question. Yeah, yeah. But uh, nah, I don't. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Sure. No, but this yeah. final score. Okay. Let's count this. <laughs> final score. We have counted points. the points. Eight points for me, six points for uh, you. God damn it! This is and I, uh, that means I get uh, my first point in the greasy duel. The score uh, on the greasy duel is two to one. That's right for I'm you. Right. Yeah, that's the uh, video. Hope you uh, enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, uh, remember to smash like on the video. If you didn't like the video. You can, to dis- smash uh, this, like. you can dislike it. Yeah, sir. Goodbye. Yeah, sir.